Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you how I painted this acrylic beautiful lake with the water lotus. Here I have this 8x10 canvas panel and first I'm going to do the sketch. I draw this line on the uh, top third uh, of the canvas panel uh, to indicate this is the uh, area for the uh, waterfall. Here on the side, there are some uh, lotus leaves. And here is a tree. And here are some uh, waterfall streams. So now let's throw some major color into this painting. I used the same color to make some lake texture. Now I make the rocks darker. Here are some light beams. Now I use this raw sienna, cat yellow, and burnt amber uh, to give the rocks some texture.
Now is the second layer for the lake. I use this deep green permanent color to paint my lotus leaves. And also apply this color on the lake to indicate some uh, shadows, uh, inflections, and the light reflection on the lake. Now I give the rocks more texture. Apply more yellow to the uh, light beam and the lake. Now I mix some uh, white with this yellow color uh, to give my lake some highlights. Uh, my palette knife tapped on the um, titanium white uh, and drag it on the on my lake to uh, get some light on my lake. Now I add more colors to my lake. Now I give the rock some shadows. Some shadows for the lotus leaves. Now I paint the first layer of my waterfall by using titanium white.
and I use my palette knife to um, paint the waterfall splash. I use white with uh, cat yellow to paint the uh, light beam again. Now I use burnt amber to paint more branches for the tree. And add this color to my lake. I mix yellow green with the aqua green to uh, make this lighter green color to highlight my lotus leaves. Now I use this deep green permanent color to paint the leaves of my tree. Now I add more texture to my lake. some uh, waterfall reflection to my lake. Now I add more highlights to my lake. I add this yellow green color uh, to my tree leaves to make my tree leaves more realistic. Now I'm painting the stems of my lotus leaves. I add more details on the lake by using different colors uh, and to make the shadow part darker. this brush full of water and titanium white and splash some water drops to my uh, lake surface. I add more different colors to my lake and darker color to refine my branches, the tree branches and the shadow of the uh, waterfall.
I mix titanium white with a little touch of the ultramarine blue uh, to make the waterfall uh, shadow and the waterfall reflection on the lake. I use this medium magenta uh, and titanium white to paint my water lotus. Uh, you don't have to mix these two colors completely so that when you paint uh, your lotus won't be in only one color it will have some texture on it so it's very realistic and easy to paint I use this deep green permanent color to paint my uh, lotus flower leaves. When you paint this reflection of the water lotus, uh, don't forget to paint the shadow underneath the uh, lotus leaf so that uh, your water lotus is floating on the lake. It's not just um, you know fake feeling like you throw it on the on your painting. Now I make my lake brighter and shiny. After my signature, my painting is completely done. You can see this is a colorful and bright and very calming painting and I like it a lot. Hope you like it too. And this painting right now is in my Etsy and eBay shops. So if you're interested in it, Please check out the information in the description box. And also, you are welcome to follow me with my Instagram. Thanks for watching. See you next time.